welcome to another chapter of Firestein Chat here by the Firestein Fireplace. Uh oh. Well, you know, I just, I just. Hey, there we go. Aren't you warmed? And look who my guest today is, Martin Short. Hello, wifey. It's Derek Huff. Hello, everybody. My friend, Doug. <gasps> look who is visiting me, Abram. What's up, what's hey, up? babe. Harvey, I'm home. <laughs> That's my daughter. I need to know, what were you like in high school? Were you, were you the class clown? I was the class clown if the teacher was weak. Then the second she turned her head, I would make fun. But if she was strict, I was as good as gold. What kind of a student were you? Oh, a terrible one. Were you on the nerd side or the cool side? I was cool in my friend group, which was just the choir and theater. Did you cut school? No. No, you no. would never cut school. No. I can't say I never was a bad kid. I can't say I never <laughs> cut school. No, I never cut school. I, I would cut class a lot. And yeah, my mom's just not finding that out. Hi, mom. The one and only Edna Turnblad joining us. Hello from Baltimore. You look very familiar. Do you have family in Baltimore? <laughs> in your childhood bedroom. Picture that. Your childhood bedroom. What'd you put up on the walls? I was huge in sports. I had posters of Ken Griffey Jr., and Michael Jordan, Tigers. I went through my dad's National Geographic. I would cut out all the Tigers. I ruined his entire collection. This is amazing, and this is not a lie. This is 100% true. I had the poster of Hairspray right above my bed. And I had the biggest crush on Zac Efron, of course. I used to have one of Justin Bieber, Robert Pattinson as Edward. It's a whole wall just of him. We didn't decorate much, no. There was the Sears catalog, of course. But I wore that to Sunday school. Did you ever make out onto the bleachers? Yes, I did. And it would have been so much more exciting had there been someone there. And why did I know we were going right there? What's your favorite dessert? Yes. Thank you. I, I see you, you, you provided, um, maybe I just smell them. Um, do you have a to-go bag? Thank you so much for tuning into these Firestein Chats. This has been such a pleasure to do this for you. I hope you learned something about my guests. I certainly did. And here by the fire, where it's always warm, thank you again for joining us. Bye-bye. <laughs>